A church in Douglas County is destroyed. A fire broke out there early this morning. Happened at Sunnyside Mennonite Church in Chesterville. That's on Route 133 between Arthur and Arcola. WCI 3's Karina Rubio was there as the church burned down. And she spoke with the pastor about that loss. All at once, the, the sky just lit up really bright. Pastor Larry Rokey watched as the church he called home turned to ashes. Firefighters got the call around 2 in the morning. I thought maybe... From what, from what it looked like on the outside that maybe we could, we could cut it off and save it. But within a few minutes, it had run that, the length of the, of the attic. The wind pushed the flames to spread quickly. The fire had too big of a head start. When it gets past a certain point where you can't save anything, then it's easier to clean up if you let some of it burn and reduce the amount that goes to the landfill. But underneath all the debris are people who've made countless memories together. This church congregation is 150 members strong. The pastor says this is certainly a tough loss. A lot of caring people that they come here every Sunday to worship. Unbelievable and hard to grasp. Pastor Rokey says Sunnyside Mennonite Church changed his life. I got saved in this basement back in 1990. But he says faith isn't housed only within church walls. It can be present anywhere. This is not the church. I mean, what you see is a building that, that has burned and collapsed. Um, but the church is still alive, and, and we're going to rise up and, and continue worshiping. In Chesterville, Karina Rubio, WCIA 3, your local news leader. Pastor Roki says they're in the process of finding a temporary place to hold services. The Arthur Fire Chief says the fire started in the north end of the church, but the state fire marshal will determine an exact cause.